Hello everybody and welcome back. It's Thomas coming back with Assassin Joe on Fallout 4. Before you saw me take out two separate dungeons, it was a fairly long video, so I apologize if you don't like really long ones. Today we are going to finish up going through the Corvega factory. Now, I am low on ammo for my silenced weapon, so I'm probably going to have to go in guns blazing, but what assassin hasn't had to do that in the movie franchises, right? Doink. I'm not that scared, lady. Especially because you were an idiot. Turrets. Super dip. I love you can loot through friggin' gore bits. Wow, I sent that one flying. I do not intend on you. <coughs> Pardon me. I do not intend on using a gamma gun at all, but there's always the possibility I might. Especially if it's got a good enough legendary modifier on it. Now, up there is a raider in power armor as well. I'm not messing with him right now, even though I have power armor. No, bud. That was a little odd. Okay, let's see. I'll be level 13 before I can put suppressors on everything. Uh, can't increase my damage anymore. I'm gonna be taking pickpocket soon. Soon. But for now, we need intelligence up. Not just for experience. I do want to modify my power armor at home. Oh shit. Either he's being attacked by the guys on top of the Corvega or he's being attacked by the one with the fat man. But... Ah! Holy Hannah! Um. I'm lucky I'm alive. I am very lucky to be alive at that one. Holy crap. That is another reason why companions in Fallout 4 just suck. The only benefit to that is Buddy might not have any mini nukes left. And then I can grab myself some Raider power armor. As crappy as it is, it's cool looking. And if you break power armor before you even take it off the armor... It sells. Ooh. Whoops. No, it just...
We good? Okay, are you guys done trying to screw me up now? Because really, you're screwing yourselves up. If I don't keep them all, they give experience. Minute amount. That just confused me. How the hell does a gunshot sound like friggin' footsteps? She must be high. Too good, more antibiotics. Love that. I'd like to say your ass is grass. Damn it, dog meat. As long as you kill that raider, you'll make up for it. Good boy. Oh, there we go. Coolant caps are for aluminum. Don't forget that. Why we grill rad stag, everybody?
the recruit died last night. Farrell got him good. Turrets didn't stop him? No, the Farrell didn't come from the pipe access down below. Nobody knows how it got in. Think somebody let it in? No, I don't think so. I swear, somebody needs to go through and board up every crack and opening they find in this place. Anyway, you gotta get going. Good luck, and be safe. And you too. See you around. You know, I hate to say it, as much as raiders are kind of asses in Fallout, it's nice to see that they at least like each other. So, reload. How nobody else heard that, I'd love to know, but you know what? I'm not going to look a gift horse in the mouth. Okay. Here's where things are going to get interesting. Good night. The hell was that? Well, I'm probably going to get shot. For you're immortal. I'm just getting started. No! Oh, man, come back. I was having fun. Where are you? I want some fun. two pieces of aluminum. What the? Damn it, dog meat. Now, you remember Gristle back in Concord? His key opens this door. You gotta be kidding me. What? Liar. You can trust me. 
Am I seriously just in caution this whole time? I'm in a gigantic suit of power armor, guys. Like, really? Slightly dehydrated. All right. No need to hide. It'll all be over soon. Yeah, but you idiots don't even go to noises, so it'll be more over for you than me. Got on you. How did you lose me? I was in front of you. Whatever. Then you come over here. There we go. And as usual, a nice chest. Keep your eyes open. No, I'm using a gigantic piece of power armor. I need some goddamn fire support. You do? Light me on fire all you like, it's not gonna do much. Not gonna run out of bullets. Sorry, lady. Disappearing at. <laughs> huh? I haven't even disappeared. I'm literally gonna be. Well, I'm gonna take the back entrance, but I know there are more raiders here to kill. But I just wanted to complete the quest, get it out of the way. There are more raiders on the roof to kill, including a bobblehead that I'll come back for. But I got more pressing matters at hand right now. low, but that's okay. You find plenty of them out in the world. Just like you find plenty of ghouls.
That was just pathetic. You okay over there, dog mate? Now to make a pit stop. On purpose. Just do that. All right. Minigun. Bye. You know what? I'm not going to use a combat knife. And I've decided against him right now. I know the rifle I want to keep with me. I don't have it right now. I will have it soon. Now I'm going to take the outskirts of town back to my save point, And I'm going to call this video here with that dungeon all said and done. Now my 10 millimeter pistol is going to kick some more butt. I love the way the power armor is now. It's a vehicle. It's no longer just a piece of clothing like the old Fallouts. Incidentally, I am going to start doing a Fallout New Vegas run through and a Fallout 3 run through soon. So I hope you guys will enjoy that because I love the Fallout series. I also have Fallout 1 and Fallout 2. So eventually I will get all of them onto my page, and I hope everybody enjoys those games as much as I do. Admittedly, I have never beaten Fallout 1, and I have not beaten Fallout 2. So it will be a very interesting thing to do to beat it with other people watching. I'm surprised Fallout 3 hasn't lagged on me anymore, but, well, can't expect everything to be perfect, especially my computer. Wahoo. Can't wait to get my favorite power armor. everybody I have now saved everything's good quest is done and I'm gonna call it a part here I know I kind of run through that dungeon but I did want to get it done to get the main game pretty much on the way so if you enjoyed it go ahead and drop me a like if you feel and I'll see you again for our next vid have a good day everyone